Recording in progress. Okay, I'm going to have Shabbos, everyone. Don't go anywhere until you hear this Dvar Torah. And I know that everybody recorded down the dates of our upcoming Yarche Kala from March 3rd to March 5th. But maybe you don't know where you put the piece of paper. So, write it down again. Please join us in Miami, March 3rd to March 5th for the first ever Yarche Kala. You're going to love it. This Wednesday, this Wednesday evening, we set over the epic vart of Rav Matasio Solomon of explaining and expanding the words of the Balaturim that two times in the Chumash it says Uli Yosef. One time it says Uli Yosef Yulad Shnei Banim Eterem Tavashnas Harav that Yosef did not engage in pleasure during the years of famine because the world was suffering. Furthermore, it says, Uli Yosef Amar Mevayrechas Hashem Artsai. And Yosef really hit it big in the end of the Torah. Rashi says, Loi Hoysa Eretz Mevayrechas Kamai Artsai Shal Yosef. Why? Says the Balaturim. Because Yosef HaTzadik was Meshtatef Bitsaras Hazulas. He joined up, he felt the pain of his friend. Therefore, he was Zoycha Mevayrechas Hashem Artsai. He was Zoycha to have the biggest and best share in Eretz Yisrael. So, says Ramat Solomon, Mamish, an, an amazing vart. Says Ramat that's why Moshe Rabbeinu tells Yosef, you know who it's coming from? Uritzayin Shoich Nisna. The will of the one who resided in the thorn bush. Because at the thorn bush, Rashi says, why does Hashem appear in the thorn bush? To show, that I feel your pain. In other words, the only time in the Torah Hashem is called the one who resides in the thorn bush is when we're explaining why Yosef gets the bracha at the end of the Torah. So my friend Rabarak Tzvi Schlesinger uh, shared two high safos to this that um, are very beautiful and worthwhile to say over. Number one, he pointed out that the Chassam Soifer says, let's go to the end of the Pasuk. Because it says, Umi meged tu aishamesh, umi meged geresh rechem emay raish, hareked umi meged giva aishailam, umi meged eret sumlaya, urit sain shaykhni isna, ta voisal raish yosef, nu, ule kad kaid, nazir echav. Why all of a sudden are we calling yosef a nazir? Why are we saying, oh, you know who gets the bracha? It goes to the head of the nazir. Okay. We know Yosef was a Nazar. But why do we have to say here in this context, he was a Nazar? Says the Chassam Soifer, why was Yosef a Nazar? Because Yosef said, I can't drink wine and enjoy myself when my father and my brother are suffering. He, again, the Torah is emphasizing the Midah of Yosef that the entire time he was Bitsar and he didn't engage in pleasure and he didn't engage in wine. Therefore it says, Uritsoin Shaykh Nisna Tavaisa the Rosh Yosef Ula Kadkai Nazir Echav. And then my friend Rabbi Shlazinger shared from Rabbi Kiva Grosnas Rosh Masifta Be Shraga and Mansi. He said a very nice addition to this. In Alamechia we say Al Eretz Chemda Taiva. Urachava Sharatsisa Vihinchalta. There's an extra word here. What do you mean Sharatsisa? Just say Alaritz Khamda Tevrachava Shehinchalta Lava Isaina. What's Sharatsisa? He says, you know, Eretz Yisrael was promised to Avraham Avinu, but Hashem never told Avraham that Eretz Yisrael would be an Eretz Zavas Khalavadvash. Where did Hashem promise that He's going to give us Eretz Zavas Chalvudvash? He did it this week's parsha to Moshe at the thorn bush. At the thorn bush. Now we know from the end of the Torah that what happened at the thorn bush was Uretzayin Shaykh Nisna. It was with Ratzayin. So we say in Alamichia, Eretz Chemda Toivur Chava. You know why Eretz Yisrael is so desirable and so good that it's in Eretz Zavas Chalvudvash? Because Sharot Sisa, you, you willed it, you wanted it. What do you mean you wanted it? Meaning as opposed to the first time where it was without Eretz, Zavas Chalavad to Avram Hashem didn't promise that. 
to Moshe at the thorn bush, he promised that. And the thorn bush, the Torah calls the Ratzon of Hashem. So in Alamichio, when we refer to the gift of the expansiveness and the desired quality of Eretz Yisrael, we say the word Sharatzisa, again signaling that it was coming from Ratzon Shaykh Nisar. Rabbi Yisai, have an amazing Shabbos. Thank you so much. Kaltav.